everyone. I'm Peter Tucci. I'm a member of the board of the Bordentown Historical Society. We're here today at Point Breeze in Bordentown, New Jersey, the former uh, palace of Joseph Bonaparte. Here's a famous painting of his mansion at Point Breeze. And as you can see here, we're doing some field work. And these are some of the tunnels that connected the various buildings at Point Breeze back in the early 1800s. Joseph Bonaparte, of course, was Napoleon's oldest brother. He was first the king of Naples and then the king of Spain, and he lived at Point Breeze for almost 20 years. So we're very excited because the state of New Jersey, the city of Bordentown, and DNR Greenway Trust are partnering to purchase this property, over 55 acres, in December of this year, 2020. And we're gonna turn this in and replicate Bonaparte Park. Joseph Bonaparte had over 12 miles of carriage trails and gardens, tunnels leading into various houses and many other very interesting features. There's only one building that survives from his era called the Gardener's House. And in conjunction with the Bordentown Historical Society, we will be making that into a Bonaparte museum that will highlight the history uh, that occurred here. It was really the center of cultural life in the United States at the time. His mansion, again, here's a, a picture of it, uh, was only second to the White House in size. It was 100 uh, feet in length on either side and 60 in the middle. So the length of it was 260 square feet. So it was a very uh, palatial um, establishment. It had the largest library in the United States, over 8,000 volumes at a time when the Library of Congress had only 6,500 volumes. And it also had the largest art collection in America at the time including the painting that you've all seen of Napoleon crossing the Alps by David. That original painting hung here at Point Breeze for 20 years. It is now at Malmaison in France. So we're all very excited about the future events and things that'll be happening here at Point Breeze, so stay tuned.